please in this video i'll be teaching you how to hem your lacquer fabric i know working with lacquer fabric can be very very difficult but sometimes i'm going to teach you this trick on how to just do it easily but please hit the subscribe button and hit also the like button thank you so much so here i'm working with what we call a hemming gum it's sold in the market in nigeria it's sold for about 300 naira and then you can just get one for yourself so it's used to hem the um, base of a dress or the bottom part of a dress so what i'm trying to do right now is to press out my dress to press out the end so that i can have a clean surface to work with so i'm just going to press it out and give it a nice press so that when i am folding it the fabric does not turn because working with lacquer can be very 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 stressful i know you can attest to this it can be very stressful so i'm just going to give it a nice press and then the next thing is that i'm going to fold it in by half inch and then press it also so i'm going to insert my hemming gum in between these folds so i'm just going to do that right now put my hem you have to be careful in this process so your iron does not touch the hemming gum while it is naked so i'm just going to put it in between and then continue to give it a nice press you have to work with a steam iron while doing this so that the press can so that it can glue immediately so just continue doing that and then you do it for the base of your dress you have to fold just once you don't have to do this twice you fold just once and then continue pressing and please be very very careful do not let the iron touch the gum alone so now as you can see i'm done with that I finished pressing it then the next thing I'm going to do is to take it to the machine and then sew so now this process you also have to be very very careful do not I repeat do not pull the fabric as you're sewing you keep on easing in so after the initial fold at the ironing table you're going to give it another fold you cannot see how I'm doing my finger I'm trying to ease it in just continue to ease it in gently as you so do not be too fast and also do not use um, a very tiny stitch so just use the medium stitch width and then continue to sew it but please be careful do not stretch the fabric and by the time you're working with this i can tell you that it gives the hemming gum gives the fabric extra strength and also it restrains it from stretching when it is placed on the fabric because if it is sewn without the hemming gum i assure you you will get a wavy effect but right now we have a straight seam without that wavy effect please thank you for watching this video kindly hit the subscribe button i love you